Not everyone's agreed to the moot. You've been here long enough to know that Nords aren't always sensible. We follow our hearts. So what? Ulfric gets this crown and then suddenly he's High King? No, it's not as simple as that. But the Jagged Crown would be a potent symbol for his cause to rally around. But if we found it first... And we gave it to Elisif. In the absence of the moot, it would further legitimize her claim. Perhaps. I'm entrusting you with what resources I can spare. But I'm warning you, if this turns out to be a waste of time and men... It won't be a waste. Make sure you take the auxiliary here. You can send him back when you get there and find nothing but old bones and cobwebs. The Stone Fist's no fool. He's found the crown, but we'll get to it first. Welcome to the Legion, Auxiliary. Listen up. Welcome to the Legion, Auxiliary. Listen up. Ulfric's right-hand man, Galmar Stonefist, has located what he believes is the final resting place of the Jagged Crown. We're going to make sure he doesn't get his hands on it. The rest of my men are already assembling outside Corvinjun. I'll meet you there as soon as I finish up here. A legendary crown, dating back to King Harald's time, or before. A powerful relic of a golden age, long since past. Legend has it that the crown is made from the bones and teeth of ancient dragons, and is said to increase the power of the wearer. Whatever the truth, if Ulfric gets his hands on it, it would be a powerful symbol around which to rally support for his cause. Well, to be frank, we don't. Its location was lost with King Borgus, when the Great Hunt killed him off while on his Leshen campaigns. Supposedly, his body was brought back to Skyrim and secretly buried with the crown. Knowledge of that location was lost in the Wars of Secession. But my agents report that Galmar is pretty damn convinced Corvin June is the tomb of King Borgus. I know Galmar. We fought in many wars together. He's not a sentimental man taken to fancy. If he believes the crown is there, he's likely found it. I am a loyal citizen of the Empire. My parents were legionnaires, and I followed in their footsteps. But more importantly, I am a daughter of Skyrim, and wish to see her made whole again. I've been a daughter of Skyrim all my life. I love this land, and her people. So do all the Nords that serve the Empire. Ulfric, too, once. He wasn't always a self-serving egomaniac. He fought in the Imperial Army in the war against the Dominion. But Ulfric and his Stormcloaks are deluding themselves. If there's any hope of a long-term victory against the Dominion, it's in the Empire. The Rebels are only inflaming the tension and weakening the Empire by distracting it from its ultimate aim. I consider this conversation over. Ulfric will want to take Whiterun from us, but we will hold fast. Watch the skies, Traveler. What's the situation? Stormcloaks were already camped out around the entrance when we got here. They don't know we're here yet. Well, that's something at least. Looks like the damned rebels got here first. No matter. We have the element of surprise. Prepare to move out. Follow me. Listen up, Legionnaires. Those Stormcloaks are here for the same reason. No! 
Well done. They never knew what hit them. But don't underestimate the Stormcloaks. Many are Legion veterans. They may be traitors, but they know how to fight. We had the advantage of surprise this time, but don't expect it to last. Let's move out! Must be the new recruit. Welcome to the Legion. spot for an ambush. Ten to one, they're just waiting for us on the other side. But there isn't any other way through, Leggett. Let's not jump to conclusions. The Legion always... Oh. 
holds is that. Is this what killed that Stormcloak over there? Can't be. Looks like it's been dead for a hundred years. Steady now. The Legion face down worse than a few dusty old bone walkers. We're not leaving here until we get what we came for. Let's keep moving. Must be the Hall of Stories. Oh, I've heard of this. These walls are supposed to show the history of the ancients who built this place. Too bad. Can't read these carvings. Who knows what secrets we'd uncover. One thing at a time, soldier. Focus on our primary mission. We're searching for the crown. Like we weren't first ones here either. Even if these carvings tell us where the crown is, I'm sure we're going to. door. Hmm, what is that? Some kind of stone claw? I wonder what it's used for. Gotta be 
Spread out. Keep your eyes open. Papa says I won't see Rob here anymore. But he wouldn't tell me why not. A wanderer like you must have plenty of tales to tell. But need something? Lead up to the Don't think you can barter with me like I'm one of those stamped shopkeepers. Pine Moon Cave is down to the southwest, but it isn't fit for exploring. There are stories. Vampires, some say. We need to stem the flow of silver to the Rebellion. Until we retake the Reach, the Stormcloaks will plunder its mines to fund further violence. Excellent work, soldier. I have to admit, I had my doubts it even existed. Did you run into any trouble? That's what I like to hear. I'll get the full report from Legged Ricca. Now then. I need someone I can trust to deliver a message of great import to Jarl Balgruf of Whiterun. We have it on good authority that Ulfric has raised enough men to attack the city of Whiterun. Jarl, however, refuses the Legion's support. This missive should convince him. Be aware, soldier. These documents contain sensitive intelligence for the Jarl's eyes only. <laughs> 